it's not like just jumping the leap of faith. It's more like a nice adventure. From the airport to hospital to hotel anywhere, we arrange it. Oncologic surgeries, it can be plastic surgeries, aesthetic surgeries, dental surgeries or dental care, or very different, the hair transplantation surgeries. We provide everything. My name is Tahsin Güney. I am the general manager of Ajibadem Healthcare Group. In the last years, Turkey is the emerging country for the medical tourism. They can have very nice, very high-end Healthcare in Turkey with an affordable price. If you compare the price with the America, North America, and the European countries, it's very, very low. For example, if you have to do a coronary uh, artery bypass grab, that's a big ticket item. You know, that could easily cost about 125000 in the US if you don't have insurance. A lot of people have to sell their homes just to get that particular treatment. If you go to countries like India, you could get it for as little as 11,000. Um, airfares inclusive, hotel, everything inclusive. Turkey has lower cost in the medical sector than compared to many other countries. There's a huge difference between the US healthcare system and healthcare system of other countries. They don't have as much lawsuit like over here. So the doctors have to have their own insurance. Most countries don't have such an established third party payers. The administrative costs because of the filing insurance claim in the US healthcare system. That's one of the big reasons that healthcare costs keep going up. Turkey has a very high quality standard for the medical interventions. In a lot of countries, the uh, qualities of the medicines sometimes are even more superior than the U.S. Turkey's medical facilities and the Turkey's physicians, healthcare worker, is very attractive. Patients can have very, very good healthcare in Turkey. And we have very good educated physicians and doctors that's very experienced on the surgeries. People always have this misconception that like you're not getting the first world medicine, you're getting the third world medicine, but that's not true anymore.